there's a critical need across the country and, and also locally. Dr. Richard Kaufman is the medical director of Transfusion Services at Brigham and Women's Hospital. He says normally the U.S. has a two to three day supply of blood, but currently the situation is getting dire. The demand has been such across the country that our suppliers have been cutting standing orders for us and for all the hospitals. Dr. Kaufman says there may be a multitude of reasons for the supply shortage, but he points directly to the fact that hospitals are simply busier as we bounce back out of the pandemic. The biggest need is those with type O blood. O pause and particularly O, o negative units, um, which is only about 6% of donors are O negative. Um, that's the kind that we need to get the most. To help with the supply, the Kraft Family Blood Center in Boston is urging donors to give blood or platelets during a drive this week. Dr. Kaufman saying it's hard to overstate how central blood is for taking care of patients. It goes to patients who are being treated for cancer, it goes to patients having surgery, for patients in intensive care, including the, the neonates in the neonatal intensive care unit. And it's a really vital support for all these types of patients. If you'd like to donate, appointments are recommended, but they are accepting walk-ins. Something to keep in mind though, make sure you bring a mask. It's required no matter your vaccination status. In Boston, I'm Doug Meehan, WCVB News Center 5.